for Everly's, it's Maddie and... Avi. <laughs> it's Maddie and Avi. Hi, Avi. So I'm actually vlogging on my camera right now. It's my huge camera though. Like literally huge, I'll show y'all. I'll put a picture right here of how big it is. Oh, it, there was a wasp. It was outside of the car. I know, it was still so scary. Um, But we are going to be shopping today. I need a few more things and I promised Avi I'd take her to Urban Outfitters. So we're gonna go to the North Park Mall in Dallas and I'm gonna let Everly pick out some stuff at the store as well. North Park is really, really bougie. So we'll probably find like another shopping center nearby. We're just going there for the Urban Outfitters because they have a really, really nice Urban Outfitters. So we're going there and I'm gonna try to vlog on this camera as much as I can. Guys, I am so sorry about this shaky freaking footage. Um, my camera's like five to 10 pounds. So yeah, I am so sorry about that. I'll definitely invest in a smaller camera that doesn't shake like this. I'm gonna try to get the, I think it's called like the, it's like a mini camera that literally you hold in your hand like this and it's tiny. And I wanna get that for vlogging. I feel like that would be so much easier because I have so much trouble vlogging. So I just use my phone. My phone's supposed to shoot in 4K through the front camera, I think. You have to change the settings. Oh. But it never does, so. You have to. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, even. Do you want me to change it for you right now? Yeah. We just, um, I had the doors off my Jeep. Aw, Cody texted you. What do you say? I love you. Aw. <laughs> well, um, I have the doors off my Jeep, but I put them back on since we are going to Dallas, and I don't really want to drive on the highways in Dallas with no doors on, because Dallas drivers are crazy. Someone will literally drive into my car. So I'm really sweaty right now from putting the doors back on me and Avi did it by ourselves because we are strong independent women There no me not Whoa, it shoots 4k at 60 frames per second Dude, you have an iPhone 11 Pro even my iPhone 7 can shoot in 4k Wait, no it can't that's 1080 never mind you just have to change the settings. Whoa! So I'm gonna vlog on my phone like when I'm in the stores and stuff, but for the most part, I'll probably log on this camera. I'm probably just gonna do the intro and outro on this camera if we're being real. Oh yeah, Avi, put the stroller in the car. I forgot it. Oh my We'll God. die without it. Okay, so we are going to head there and I will see y'all there. Just got to the mall. I've got my mask on. She's copying Avi because Avi was coughing because she put her mask on and it's not bad. So we are headed in right now. We are ready to go. I'm gonna grab my stroller and get Everly put in there and we're gonna just do some quick shopping. Everly was so persistent on bringing her pancakes in. So she's eating pancakes in her stroller right now. I'm not gonna let her out of the stroller unless she wants to look around because COVID. But this is my outfit today. I really like it. I got these pants from the thrift store, shoes from Walmart, shirt was thrifted, purse was thrifted. We love it. Everly decided she's gonna push her stroller into a wall apparently and we're gonna let her pick out some clothes at H&M. Do you want to get close? Oh she sees something she wants. What's that? Cat ears. Do you want to get cat ears? Yes. There's other ones right here too. And there's a flower crown. Which one do you like? Um. Oh this flower crown's so pretty Everly. Do you see that one? You want a purse? <laughs> Girl. Mm. Oh, it's a shopping bag, huh? <laughs> mm. So we're gonna get these. Let's see. $4.99. You got them. Okay, now let's go look at the clothes. Girl. <laughs> that fits your size? Okay, I love these. Aww. Everly, look at these. Do you like these? That's for winter, dude. We don't even want her clothes. Do you like these? Yes! Okay. Let me get you size. Let me get you size. There you go. Maddie, how am I supposed to film when you just have your ass to the camera the whole time? I really. Smile. The quality is horrible because I'm vlogging on Avi's phone. She took mine, but we are getting some Chipotle right now. We just got back from H&M. Really yeah, you're endless. Huh? But, um, we just went, got back from H&M. 30 bucks, new record, amazing. So we're gonna get some Chipotle. 
I'm gonna put subtitles on if y'all can't hear me because I don't want to take my mask off but we're gonna get some Chipotle sit down to eat and I'll be able to talk better once we're sitting down eating because we can take our mask off then so we just got Chipotle and the lady was so rude like I was just ordering and I didn't know if she heard me because she didn't say anything and she was just like she like grabbed all my stuff and she was just like throwing it around and um, I said can I please get another spoon and she slams open the door slams it back and hands me a, like literally throws me a spoon so um North Park Mall Chipotle lady we don't like you the boob book and she is reading it do you like boobs Everly? Everly why do you like boobs you like them? <laughs> Say cheese. Show me the book. Everly, show me the book. <laughs> we are done shopping. Um, we just got back in the car. We got quite a lot at Urban Outfitters. And I didn't really vlog very much in there. And like, shopping at Urban Outfitters... Oh, my lash is falling off. That's amazing. I saw it. Shopping at Urban Outfitters, like, is really, really expensive. So, <laughs> we didn't get much, but like, we got a lot for like the prices because we found really good prices and like sale rack stuff but we are headed home no we're actually headed to Paige's work to get Paige and I will see y'all there my lash is still falling off like it does not want to stay it's just this tiny little part that's going up lord okay you know what we're just gonna deal with it I look ridiculous but that's okay we have Cody we stole him yeah so um we also have <laughs> I really fell asleep but um we are going to this place now called dirt cheap that I've been wanting to go to forever my mom's friend told me about stay but, um we're going to this place called dirt cheap and it's supposed to have like really good deals and stuff and then I think I'm gonna take Everly to like Old Navy or something to get more shopping done because she didn't get much at the mall like she didn't really want anything else there wasn't a huge selection for baby stuff that's not like a thousand dollars at the Gucci store so we are going to go to dirt cheap and then I'm gonna let Everly shop around somewhere else and then we might go get dinner or something who knows but oh my god when we were in the mall this person was standing like really close to me in the store they like literally shoved past me they were like an inch away from me so I just started having like a coughing fit like I forced myself to have a coughing fit and I did it so realistic too like I can fake a good cough because I used to do it to get out of school like listen to this hold on <coughs> you see I can force myself to cough like that so I was just in the store like <coughs> <coughs> and then this one person was standing like right by me ignoring the social distancing thing ding stickers and um I just said Avi mom's test came back from corona right was it positive and av was like she got mad at me she's like daddy don't do that <laughs> so um yeah i'm not actually sick i can just force myself to cough like that i don't know why i guess i'm just gifted so are you disappointed in <laughs> I am. okay you told me to just start coughing on people <laughs> i did <laughs> Yeah, like, whenever people would get super close to me, I'd just start coughing so I'd get away. Because, like, honestly, with all this corona stuff going on... Um, I, I don't want people to be close to me when I'm out. Like, I follow the social distancing very, very seriously. And the mask wearing. So, I don't know. I just try to stay away from people at all costs. I do that when there's no pandemic, too, though, so... I will see y'all at the store. Okay, so Cody is holding my phone so I can vlog. I'm not gonna make him hold my camera because like it's hard to vlog on my camera, even for me. So we just got back from Dirt Cheap. Ton of stuff, only 50 bucks. Like literally so much stuff. I even got a pair of shoes. So um, I, yeah, she got a pair of shoes too. So we got a ton of stuff, but um, during, when we were shopping, like everything was good. I was just digging through this huge thing of swimsuits because they had so many little girl swimsuits. So I was just digging through it. Then Avi brings me Everly. She's like, um, please tell me that's not what I think it is. And there was just <laughs> no, diarrhea. What did you say? Well, it's not. Um, YouTube friendly. Oh. I said, and you can leak this out or take it out. I said, Please tell me that's chocolate, not sh <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember that. 
what? There were chocolate bunnies she was um, playing with. Her. This is the she's most I've ever me. seen her poop ever. And it was running all down her legs, into her shoes, on her dress, everywhere. This is the first time she's had like a blowout in so freaking long. Like literally she hasn't had a blowout since since she was one. <laughs> She's she's not upset about it. I told her like I told her it's okay. Accidents happen. We'll go to the car and get you all cleaned up, sweet girl. And she was just really scared. And then shopped around for a bit. She was fine. And then she had diarrhea again. Yeah. Oh yeah, diarrhea. Yeah. Say no more juice for me. Yeah, no more juice for you. She was at her friend's house the other day and they drank a lot of juice and they ate fruit popsicles and sometimes juice can just like mess with toddlers poops that's why when you give them apple juice you have to water it down but I'm on my way home now and I'm gonna do a quick little haul I'm gonna have Cody go home when we get home there was also this guy at the checkout telling me how he railed his girlfriend Gonna get he, he gave me a <laughs> discount though, so it's okay. I was like so scared he was gonna try to flirt with me because I just kept looking over at Cody and like, bro, what are you? But he never saw me because he was like playing with Everly. So, wait, let's be I, I glanced over, I saw him talking to you, and he was all smiling. I was like, mm. yeah, it was definitely like. I don't know how he was trying to act, honestly, but I wasn't like incorporating it. I was just being nice and like trying to get rid of the conversation because he was like, yeah, yeah, me and this girl, Maddie, we broke up or this guy broke me and my girlfriend, Maddie up, my ex, and I thought you were her for a minute and your name's Maddie too, that's crazy. And um, he tried to buy Cody's Whataburger mask off of him. I don't have another mask, and he's just like, oh, you can have mine. <laughs> I don't think that's sanitary. Um, but no offense to the guy. Like, I just thought the things he was saying were funny. Not work appropriate, but definitely funny. And he gave me discounts, so we're good. But um, I am heading home right now. I just hopped on the expressway, and I'm going to send Cody home. And, uh, oh, this is the next one. Oh, I'm supposed to go to the exit only. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna go give Emma a bath and then I will give y'all a haul. And so I got Slate something to wear for his birthday party tomorrow and I'm gonna show it to him. Slate, I got you something to wear for your birthday party. What is it? A hot dog. <laughs> Do you wanna put it on? Do you like it? Oh, you give me a hot dog? Oh, no presents. No, don't look. There's presents in there. Okay. Put it on, Slate. Put it on. So I just gave Everly a bath. She pulled off my lashes in the bath. But I had to wash her off because of the poop. I'm letting her have a few bites of chocolate, but no more after that. Just a few bites because we're waiting on a food delivery. So um, she hasn't ate much. I'm trying to give her cheese as well. I'm letting her take a bite of chocolate after she takes a bite of cheese just to make her eat the cheese. It's working so far. But um, we're waiting on a food delivery. Uh, nope, cheese first. Take a bite of cheese, then you can have a bite of chocolate. So we are waiting on a food delivery. And... <laughs> We will see y'all in a minute. She's no longer eating the chocolate, just using it as a microphone. Mama. Can I, can you hear me? No. What are you saying? Oh, mama. You're crazy. Mama. This is our dinner. We got some cheese fries, mac and cheese for Eb. Yep. And this is an impossible burger with guacamole on it. Hey guys, it is like two days later and I am just now getting around to film this little haul. So yesterday was Sunday and it was Slate's birthday party and that was like an all day event and on Sunday we spent the night getting ready for Slate's birthday party and today I really had gymnastics and I have to edit and post this video. So I just wanted to come in and do this little haul for the outro. So I was going to do a try on haul but I like stretched out my sprained a muscle somewhere in like my side carrying all the stuff from Slate's birthday party and I just really don't want to put the extra strain on myself because it it hurts so I'm just gonna show y'all everything I got so I got these from the clearance section 
they're like some paint sweater jeans and it's actual real paint like you can just tell by the texture and some of it's like flaking off even I have no idea what brand these are but they were from or Urban Outfitters and I really like them they're men's though but I'm still gonna wear them so next up this is I think my favorite thing I got everyone's wearing like the corset lacy tops now and I got one I really love it and it's really cute so yeah and then I got these jeans they're just like huge skater jeans and they have like the little pockets I have another pair of the same jeans but these ones are black with like white embroidery or stitching and they have tons of pockets and I love them but with this brand BDG I recommend sizing up because their stuff is pretty small and then I also got the booby book y'all saw Everly pick out um, it's in my room somewhere and then so I had to like empty out the H&M bag in my car to put the poopy diaper in when she had the little explosion at the store so I don't have the H&M stuff with me but she got this cute little um, butterfly skirt and she had um, she got a Spongebob dress and she wore that like right after the whole diaper thing so so it's dirty right now but it's this cute little Spongebob dress she also got some kitty cat ears and a little purse and then I'm gonna show y'all some of the stuff we got at Dirt Cheap it's oh I found the I found the shorts they were in the Dirt Cheap bag um, they're just some little flowery shorts from H&M $10 which is kind of high for these but they're really cute yeah. and then at Dirt Cheap I let her pick out a lot of stuff because it is literally dirt cheap she got this little unicorn and I'll show you all the other stuff we got um, it was Everly. It was twenty for a dollar Easter candy, so I just let her pick out like a bunch of Easter candy, and we just have like a crap ton of Easter candy now. And Avi picked out this um, blockbuster DVD, Best in Show. I got these shoes for me, which Mama, I really like. They were like five bucks. Mama, me one. They got this. Okay, I'll look. And then Everly picked out this. Spider-Man costume, which was super cheap. Okay. And then this was literally like a Target brand pajama set. And I got this for like a dollar. And she picked out a creeper swimsuit. Also, she's trying to put on her Spider-Man suit. She got this little frozen shirt. It was like a dollar. And she also got some other little swimsuits. Let me see if I can find them. I'm in the middle of doing laundry in here, so everything's just like really spread out. Oh, these are the bottoms for her little jammies. And they have like the cute little waistband. They also had like a little Elsa costume, but Everly decided she didn't want it. So this is some stuff that Orange Juice, the brand, sent me. I will link them down below. But um, I just wanted to put this in our haul because it like arrived th around the same time. She's not Spider-Man. But um, Orange Juice, the brand, sent me this. They will be linked down below. And so the packaging is really cute. It says orange juice the brand with like a little orange juice jug. And then it says like amount per package iconic total OJ Queen confidence 500 grams 100%. Like it's just all really cute. Right by you. This is a shirt they sent me. It just says orange juice the brand. It's really cute and simplistic. I have a pair of orange biker shorts that I wore this with. And it was a really cute outfit. Um, This is a hoodie. That's really cute. It's oversized too. I'm not sure. If I, like if I'll wear it yet because it's just not really the type of material I like to wear I'm really weird about materials sometimes so I'm gonna link my Depop down below I might be selling this on my Depop I love it I just don't think I would wear it and I want to put it to you so I'll probably sell this on my Depop and that will be linked down below and then this is my favorite thing they sent me this is an oversized button-up and it says orange shoes the brand right there and I love their little logo I think it's really cute so this isn't sponsored by the way they sent me these to put them in my haul but it's not sponsored so i don't know is that sponsored i have no idea but um yeah they sent me this stuff thank you orange juice the brand i totally like i really love this it's really cute and it's so soft and it's really nice material so that's it for my haul also i wore the outfit the jeans i got with the corset top i got i'll put a picture right here it was fire like I absolutely loved it and I felt so confident in it. I will see y'all in the next video. I'm going to go lay down with fussy pants so she can get some rest. 
But I hope y'all enjoyed this little haul and shop with me. I had a lot of fun. And once again, we were really careful shopping. We maintained social distancing. We wore our masks. And I literally carried Germex in the stroller with me. So we would Germex constantly. So just remember to stay safe while going out and resuming your normal lives. Like, just stay safe, wear your mask, social distance, and don't go out if you're feeling sick. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel. I recently noticed that only like 50% of people that watch my videos are subscribed. So if you're a part of that 50% that isn't subscribed, go subscribe right now and click the notification bell. Please, please, please. Like, I'm begging you. <laughs> Do it for the algorithm. You can unsubscribe later. <laughs> but I'm, I'm kidding, but like, Subscribe if you want to. Like, just a little reminder. You can subscribe to me and support me and my daughter. So, I hope y'all enjoyed this video, and I will see y'all next time. Bye, guys.